Hey what's up guys? <clears throat> hey what's up guys? It is me, Dr. Minecraft here for the game so now. Anyway, this is the second video that I'm putting up today, and it's going to be a review of my survival world. Now I'm I'm in normal mode, and as you can see I've gotten pretty far. This statue is something I built out of pure boredom boredom. I'm probably going to tear it down. It's a waste of gold, iron cobble, you know, I don't need cobblestone. Anyway, so, you would see this, and th you would see this little shack outside, and think, I'm the poorest man in the world. But, you just open this door, and a small staircase leads down into... So much lag. Into the main room. So, in the main room, we got three little crafting tables. We got three beds, so you know, for me to sleep in. We got um, my nether portal, which I use very not frequently. And you walk back up the staircase, come down this one, come down here, and there's a door right here which leads to all of my mines. And then we got all my chests, all my furnaces, some of my anvils, my my anvils. And I got an enchantment room, I just don't have any bookshelves yet. Anyway, so I'm gonna start right here with when we come down, we have minerals and crap. So this is a crap chest. I have uh, I know some of you guys will say, oh that's not crap, it's crap to me because I don't have a use for it. So we got eleven seeds, uh, one feather, dirt. 64 dirt, 49 gravel, 2 flint, 62 dirt, 9 oak saplings, 11, 11 strings, 8 gunpowder, 9 arrows, 3 rotten flesh, 3 pieces of paper, 2 sugar canes, 2 books, 1 piece of wool, and 7 bones. Now, let's move on into my minerals chest. Where I have a lot of minerals. I have three blocks of diamonds and then 52 diamonds. I have one emerald, five blocks of iron, two pieces of iron. I have a lot more iron, a lot of it's used in my statue. I have three blocks of gold, three regular nuggets or whatever. Eight, five blocks of coal, eight blocks of lapis lazuli with one of that. Um, 16 blocks of redstone and six pieces of redstone, and then I have a uh, uh, music disc 13, cat and cat, and then I have an enchantment book with bay and oak arthropods. Five, four, that's all. So now let's start on the right and go down. This is my cobblestone chest. As you can see, I have a lot of cobblestone. Is that um. Nothing in my furnaces that I need to collect. Okay. Um, this is my wood chest. You know, I got wood. And, sorry, I'm really tired today. We got wood and sticks. And I'm gonna come over here. Into my tools box. I have my first wooden pickaxe, which, only, which I only dug three pieces of stone with. So, anyway, we got a uh, wooden pickaxe and an iron helmet. A stone sword, a stone axe, uh, an iron sword with one breaking one, a pair of shears, a stone shovel, a saddle, two crafting tables, four buckets, two name tags, some diamond horse armor, a furnace, flint and steel, um, a diamond pick with one breaking one and efficiency one, and a diamond sword with sharpness one. So with that chest, I have a food chest, which is barely anything in it. It's just 25 cooked pork chops, some raw chicken, some raw beef, and some bread. That's about it for this world. Um, oh yeah, I got some crafting tables right here. Got full enchanted iron armor. I got protection one, unbreaking one, projectile protection one, and protection one, unbreaking one. On this. Excuse my stretching and yawning. 
so this is the survival world. I've been going at this for a couple of days now. If I check my statistics, I've played it for almost five hours. And yeah. So I've jumped a lot, I've dealt a lot of damage, I've taken a lot of damage, I've killed mobs mobs. Let's see, I've killed five skeletons, I've never been killed by a skeleton, I've killed one spider, I've never been killed by a spider, I've killed 21 zombies, I've never been killed by a zombie, I've killed 25 pigs, never been killed by a pig, sheep, two, cow, four, chicken, one. The only reason I have a lot of zombies is because, um, ah, the only reason I have a lot of zombies is because I actually found a mob spawner, a zombie spawner, I found two already, I, and I used one of them as a mob trap and I got a lot of zombie kills and levels with that most of my other levels came from my diamonds was it so um anyway guys tomorrow I will be putting up a video another modded survival video and I just want to talk about this for a second I'm going to be doing another modded survival video tomorrow because tomorrow's Friday but I want your guys' opinion. Do you want me to either a the uh, transfer the modded survival onto this world, b um keep this world, or c re revamp the series altogether on an entirely new map? Uh, in my opinion, I want to revamp it altogether on an entirely new map because I started that series the wrong way. Trust me. I know how to survive now. I've got it done. So, A, B, or C. Leave it in the comments below. A, put my modded survival onto this world. B, keep the world. Or C, restart it all together. Just tell me what you want in the comment section down below, or if you have any other suggestions, just let me know. Uh, that's about it, guys. Thanks for